A big mistake that many beginning developers make is trying to build an application without having a clear idea of what exactly they're trying to build. But this is like driving to a new destination without a map. You might make a little progress in the right direction, but you probably won't get to where you need to go. You don't need to have everything figured out from the beginning, but you do need to have some kind of plan. With this in mind, we're going to build Leaderboard, an application that the Meteor Development Group designed to show off Meteor's features. Leaderboard has since been replaced by more advanced examples on the official website, but we're going to build this project for a couple of reasons. First, the application already exists. This means we can get a good idea of what we're trying to build before we write a single line of code. And second, the application is simple. This means we don't have to think too hard about the conceptual aspects of building software, which is usually the most difficult part. Instead, we can focus purely on learning Meteor itself. To get hands-on time with Leaderboard, visit leaderboard.meteortips.com. Play around with the application and notice that there's a list of players, each player has a name and a score, players are ranked by their score, users can select players by clicking on them, and after selecting a player, users can increment that player's score by clicking the Give 5 Points button. In later chapters, we're going to add a number of our own features to the application, but even just building the application's original features will allow us to cover a lot of Meteor's most interesting functionality.